Whenever you want me to step in <laughs> for you, I'd be happy. Keeping with Ellen reading the Bethany. Oh, sorry, oh, I left my glasses out. Uh, I'll see if there's anything. Uh, at some point, if you've had a child, they've probably been very sick. And I have three children, and at some point, they've all been very sick. And so this is for my children. Um, sometimes my daughter's anger outweighs mine. She throws it around, a sucker punch flying over my head, barely missing my temple. I breathe in the toxic fumes for her, let them settle in the pit of my belly, throw an umbilical cord right down the center of my leg into my big toe where all this lasts but a moment and is buried in the sand I kick off to the side. Sometimes my daughter's anger outweighs mine. There's no one who makes her laugh. The joy in her life seems to have vanished with the illness consuming her gut. If I could take her anger away, I would. But she has cut me out, exercised me as though I were the demon filling her limbs with black magic. Sometimes my daughter's anger outweighs mine, and the house's walls begin to cave in with the fear that she will not survive this week. With her stubbornness keeps us all hoping she will recover soon. We climb the walls in anticipation of the next few days when life could go back to normal or not. And I don't think about it until sleep. I sleep when she sleeps. Sleep. <laughs>